Hi, so in my last video I spoke about the M form course in general and in this video I wanted to talk about the M form course at the University of Bradford which is where I went. There was actually two options at the University of Bradford for pharmacy. The first course option is that you do four years of studying and then one year of the pre-registration year and that's what all the universities offer. The second option is a five-year course so in your fourth year you'll spend six months working then six months studying in your fifth year you'll spend another six months working and six months studying in terms of entry requirements you need to have biology or chemistry a level and another science um, a level so you could do biology and chemistry and you need to get them both um, both of those sciences at grades a and b the School of Pharmacy at Bradford Uni runs on what is called a spiral curriculum which basically means that every year the knowledge and, and the learning builds up from what you were taught last year so it becomes more complex um, as the years go on. First year you basically just recap um, A-level biology and chemistry. Um, it was definitely the easiest year um, and it was also the year that I would recommend that you get involved with everything else at the uni, so like all the societies and events. Second year is quite a big jump from first year because that's when you start to learn about um, all the health conditions that can happen to the body and you start to look at medicines as well to treat those conditions. In third year you build up on all of those conditions that you've learned in second year and all of the treatment options. I would say third year was easier for me than second year um, because I knew what I was doing, um, so I knew how to get a good grade. But in terms of content, second year was easier and first year was the easiest. But in the first term of your fourth year, you cover all the sort of non-clinical things. You're looking at patient safety and decision making, which is the law and ethics of pharmacy. You do your reflection, your dissertation, which is a project um, of your chosen topic. You do your maths exam as well. It probably wasn't my favourite term. I found some of it a bit boring because I am very much into all the clinical, sciencey part of pharmacy, which this bit just didn't have, but the information that you learn is really, really important. And then in the final term of fourth year, you prepare for your OSCE exams. They're basically practical exams which involve role playing when you have to act as the pharmacist to um, address certain situations. Most people will tell you the OSCEs are just so hard. <laughs> you spend the whole term going over all of the clinical information that you've covered in the past um, four years of the degree. It is the hardest term of the whole degree. Um, but of course, if you've studied well and you've practiced, um, it, should, it shouldn't be too difficult, it should be manageable. So basically what happens is, um, for each topic that you're going to learn, you get given um, a pack, which can be like an online document um, with all the information that you need to know, or it will have links to the resources that you need to use to get that information. And then you'll be tested on that information they, those tests happen quite regularly. Those test grades will contribute to some of your final year grade. Something that's really unique to the University of Bradford's pharmacy course is um, team-based learning. Whilst you're studying those packs, you have TBI lessons, which is where you're in a group and you have to work through scenarios and situations that you might encounter as a pharmacist and how to best deal with them. Because you're working in a group, you obviously learn to work as a team and you get some great um, skills that you need to apply uh, once you become a pharmacist. Advantage of TBL is that, as I said, you get to um, work as a team and you get to um, share ideas and learn from each other. The disadvantage is obviously that you're um, in a team, it's actually the same thing, it's that you're in a team and if you are put with people that don't work that hard, you have to start working harder to make up for it. Karma hit me because I did not do any work in first year. Um, second year I did a bit. Third year and fourth year I was doing like so much of the work and I'm actually really glad that I did it because it, it taught me so much during those TBL sessions. So that's about all from my understanding of the pharmacy degree. But thank you for watching. If you guys have any questions um, or queries or concerns or worries or anything <laughs> just let me know in the comments below my is so much better here i should have filmed it here i guess you've just got to deal with the bad stuff to get the good stuff here you here, and also here.
Bye, bye. Bye.